How relevant is statistical machine learning in the age of Gen AI? Should you learn statistical machine learning or directly jump to learning Gen AI, LangChain and so on? This question is similar to how relevant are motorbikes in the age of cars? Well, obviously there are situations where motorbikes are better compared to cars. In this video, I'm going to mention few points or few scenarios where using statistical machine learning is better compared to Gen AI. Point number one is motorbikes provides a direct connection between the rider and the road you have better control let's say if something goes wrong or if you want to uh, kind of uh, interpret the behavior of it then motorbikes are easier compared to cars similarly statistical machine learning models such as linear regression logistic regressions they are easier to interpret all you have is coefficient and when you give the input you can even write mathematical equation and interpret the results compared to that gen ai models are not that easy to interpret they are like black box and your ai explainability is lower in the fields like finance and healthcare where there are regulations and the requirements are such that you need high interpretability in this situation statistical machine learning models are better i have a friend who works in a finance company they are building credit risk model and in that case they sometimes prefer logistic regression over some complex model let's say some neural network model even though it is giving let's say three or four percent more accuracy they will go for logistic regression because it has high interpretability it has high explainability the second point is motorcycle Vehicles consume less fuel compared to cars. Similarly, statistical machine learning models they consume less compute resources when it comes to training as well as inference. For LLMs, you need GPUs, your compute cost, electricity cost will be higher for training as well as inference. The next point is motorcycles are agile in congested traffic. Let's say you are in a Bangalore traffic and if you're going through motorbike, you can maneuver easily compared to car. If you have a big car, then moving that car is harder. Statistical machine learning models are simple. Even if you have a smaller data set, they will work okay. Avoiding the need of massive uh, training data and complex architecture. The next point is motorcycle are best when you are navigating narrow roads let's say if you are navigating narrow roads let's say if you are going a village and the road is really smaller uh, people prefer bikes compared to cars so similarly statistical machine learning models are better for narrow tasks where you have a small data set where precision and structured outcome is the key the next point is motorcycles are easier to maintain compared to cars when you change engine oil in motorcycle it will be easier compared to cars both in terms of convenience as well as the cost let's say if you have mercedes and something is broken or let's say if, even if you want to do a regular service the cost will be higher in cars compared to motorcycles similarly statistical machine learning models are easier to maintain let's say you deploy it in production there is some data drift you want to train it on new data set you can quickly train it Compared to that, Gen AI models, when you want to fine tune train it, they are a little bit harder and costlier. The next point is motorcycles are cost effective for some type of trips. Let's say you are going in that village trip, then the overall cost for motorcycle will be less compared to cars. So there are some tasks in the world of AI for which if you use statistical machine learning or Gen AI, both will work. But when you use statistical machine learning, you will end up spending less money. You will get quicker result. It is like you want to cut something. And for that, you are using sword instead of knife. Knife here is statistical machine learning and sword is Gen AI. All right. So when you're working on your next machine learning or AI project, please keep these points in mind if you have any question there is a comment box below if you are interested in learning statistical machine learning using scikit-learn i have a free playlist on youtube if you want more structured learning then check out this bootcamp on codebasics.io